Hey guys, Rush Richardson here. Behind me, I got an all new 2022 Black Label Lincoln Navigator. Going to give you a run through of what this thing looks like. It's crazy. This is one of the nicest cars Lincoln's ever built. Just going to do an exterior walk around for you guys. As you can see, they got the new headlights on the Navigator here. So you have the adaptive pixel, jeweled LED headlamps. You also have the Black Label grille, a little bigger than before. Notice that these are all Lincoln logos here. Black Label rims blacked out side badging super beautiful car on the outside here love 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 the way it looks get close up of the rims here Apologize for the wind. We're only going to have this car for a day or two because it's already sold. So I just want to make the video as quick as I could because I don't know when we're going to get another one of these due to the chip shortage. They're pretty rare right now. Take you guys on the inside. Take a look at that. All right, guys. Here's the inside of the Black Label Lincoln Navigator. You have your Chalet Edition Black Label theme, Alpine Venetian leather. If your new instrument cluster here with the new steering wheel similar not quite the same as the old one you have a couple different buttons here this is like your lane keeping button a part of your adaptive cruise control this also has the self-driving on the highway um, technology which is new to the navigator some similarities over here is pretty much the same they do they did add a couple extra buttons for the massage seating that you can access and turn on your massage or you can also adjust the different lumbar supports in there center dash looks about the same from the previous model year um, but it was super nice before so there wasn't a need to change that at all i just love the way this car looks it is so so nice looking tons of room in the back seat there tons of cool stuff in the touch screen you have your wireless apple carplay android auto you have all your different radio controls in here pretty easy to use bluetooth and all that fun stuff of course does have factory navigation which is really simple and easy to use as well you can use the apple carplay and android auto if you like to use your app such as Waze or anything like that but um, you can use it through the car in the settings here you do have some fun stuff like your you have your ambient lighting which is always cool to play around with pick the different colors do have a wireless charger in here too which is nice and easy to get to tons of room in the center console here You also have your different drive modes too. So if we take a look here, you can see those up here. Run you through them. You have normal, four by four, slippery mode, deep conditions, slow climb, conserve, excite. So a ton of cool drive modes in there. You also have your Revel Ultima 3D stereo system. You have 19 speakers throughout this vehicle. Trust me, it bumps, it's super good. It's a great stereo station. In the back seat here, they changed. You have this little screen here. Um, before, one of my only complaints about the Navigator, before you had something like right here, and they were like cheap little plastic buttons, and I thought, you know, for a $100,000 car, you should at least have a screen. But, you know, you could do the heated and cold seats back here, climate controls, do the radio and all that fun stuff from back here. Um, and then in the settings here, you do have, this is cool. It's like the calm screen. Just gives you like the radio. Um, can't really pick, not really picking up on the camera here, but it's like a galaxy of stars here. Um, oh, this is satisfying. Oh, yeah. I just wanted to run you guys through what's new in the Navigator, though. I've already made a Navigator video, and I'll link that somewhere in here where I really go over a lot of the stuff in the Navigator. This was like a mid-cycle refresh. So like I said, the grill and a couple other pieces of technology. And of course, you got to make the screen bigger, bigger, bigger. Every, every time they change a car, it's got to have a bigger screen. But if I missed anything, let me know. Let me know what else you'd like me to review. Uh, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I appreciate all the support and all the videos. Have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.